What's up, this is Ross with Tactics. Right now you're checking out the Nike SB Janoski Hyperfeel. As you can see, it's that same classic Janoski upper with the Hyperfeel technology and the outsole and insole. So it has that same Costin 3 outsole, very grippy and a lot of flex grooves to give you natural board feel. Gonna be nice and flexible out of the box. Won't take a whole lot of time to break these in. And it has a lot of rubber up there on that toe to give you a more grippy, better flick. Um, Key story, like I said, is that Hyperfeel technology. So what you get with the Hyperfeel is almost zero material in that outsole except for the rubber. So that's gonna make it very thin and very flexible. So they're able to give you an outsole that has padding only where they want it. This insole is made out of Lunarlon. So it's very thick under the heel and then it thins out under the toe for a little better flexibility, lots of flex grooves. It's really similar to the Costin 3 insole, almost the exact same shape. It, the Costin 3 feels a little thinner because it does have the zoom air unit for a little extra support, but overall it's gonna feel really similar, a little bit thicker, so probably a little bit more support on this Janoski. Um, besides that, obviously it's the upper you're familiar with, big one piece toe with suede, lace harness with the lace set high and away from the wear area so you're not ripping, ripping too many laces. There are a few differences though. On the heel, it does have quite a bit more padding. It's a nice, cushy, soft feeling collar. So it's gonna be a little more comfortable. I never really liked the way that the Janoski was so thin. It kind of rubbed on my ankle. Um, also, it has this elastic band that comes in, attached to the collar very high. So it's really similar to the slip-on. So it's gonna feel kind of like a slip-on, but you still have those laces, so you can cinch it up nice and tight there, which is great. Uh, comes in a ton of different colors, as you can see. It comes out fall 2016. If you have any more questions, go ahead and drop those in the box below or head over to tactics.com to check them out.